Hi everyone and welcome to day three of the course. Uh, today's topic is going to be what teacher skills can help a global collaborative project be successful. So let's just move on over to the Moodle. A um, little bit of housekeeping before we start. Uh, one thing, there's been quite a bit of talk about Twitter in the last day or so, and I think that Brad's going to take on trying to collect people's Twitter handles. Um, I've been tweeting about the course uh, using EdTechBC as the hashtag. If anybody wants to suggest a uh, course hashtag, we could probably do something with that as well if we have enough tweeters uh, in the house. There has also been talk of trying to find um, somewhere uh, for people to share projects that they are doing or are interested in finding people to help with. And I think we'll do something with the wiki to do with that uh, to be determined. So for today's course, I've added three uh, separate resources. The first link here, uh, just some resources to get you thinking. Um, I've uh, added a link to uh, a really nice post. Um, somebody who participated in a in collaborative project, um, good reflections on kind of what made it successful. Also, um, things that didn't work. Um, the video that I've embedded on the wiki is from uh, Vicki Davis's uh, K-12 online um, presentation this year called Lead the World. So this link here will take you to the entire presentation. I've just embedded the second half of the presentation. And it talks about these seven principles which we'll use today, uh, or we could use today, I should say, um, to guide some of our conversation around teacher skills. And I've also added a couple of links to my blog at the bottom if you care to read them. Um, so then there is the video of Vicky. Uh, she's a very passionate educator and does a really nice job talking about um, a lot of the design elements that need to be present in a successful uh, project of any kind, but global collaborative project in general. So if you haven't already, I encourage you to watch that video. I went a little, cra I went a little crazy on the day three discussions. My original goal was to set up the discussions around the seven design elements that Vicky talks about, and I think that there's a lot of great discussions we could have about what teacher skills do we need to connect, um, what, what do we need to communicate, to collaborate, to teach digital citizenship. So if any of those interest you, it'd be uh, wonderful to hear what you have to say. I did add a couple other um, discussion threads because I couldn't help myself. Uh, the first one was inspired by Pauline's um, if you haven't read it yet, you need to read it. Um, her description of collaboration as being like bread making. And I thought it, we haven't really in this course yet actually discussed what do we mean by collaboration? What does it actually, um, it, it's, it's, it's a word, so what does it actually mean? So that's, that was sort of the gist of that discussion thread. And then as I was struggling to catch up on missing half a day of this course, um, I was starting to think a lot about workflow and, and how it could be as efficient as possible in accessing this information, responding to you all, connecting with you all. So uh, I've written a fairly lengthy introduction to this form post. The basic um, gist of it is, though, I thought it might be interesting. Uh, we have a lot of experienced educators in the room. It might be interesting to share our workflows. Uh, how do we all manage um, all this information? How do we all stay connected without spending um, the entire day glued to our computer screens and ignoring our families. Um, so I've shared a little bit of my workflow here. I've also shared um, a good link to a place you can go to learn more about RSS and Google Reader, which is the way a lot of people pull information to themselves, and a couple of good blog posts on, on being a connected edu educator. So hope uh, hope some of this is useful to you, and I look forward to seeing what the discussions look like on day three.